All right, I think I'm gonna get 87 rune crafting. Whoa, there it is, 87 rune crafting. Really nice. Just been chilling here and getting some levels. Ooh wee! You got a whip, boy. That's what I'm talking about. Boom, boom, boom. Well, I got a duplicate chest plate. Um, um, I didn't really need that, but I mean, 40 mil added to the bank is always nice. I would have really loved another uh, chest skirt, but that's all right. I mean, I mean, 40 mil to the bank is pretty cool, so we'll we'll just roll with that, you know. So I'll take it. We got a God Sword Shard 1. That's a pretty rare drop. I'm uh, not sure if I need one, but that's good. Right here we are opening a hard glue casket. Let's see what we get. <laughs> oh my god, that is so junk. 39k rip. Alright, and here goes an elite glue casket. Ooh, a master's. Oh no, now I have to do my second master's. I'm terrified. I've only done one master clue before. Oh god. Ooh, snap. I got another Abbey Demon task and another whip. Here we go. Dang, the collection's going up. I think I have eight, not including my tentacle whip. Hey guys, so I have forgotten to record a couple of levels and I thought I would just go over them with y'all. I went from 86 to 88 prayer doing a clan event. We were at the Chaos Altar event, which was really fun. And so I was unable to record and I got 97 Slayer at Armadil and I was bossing so I wasn't really paying attention when I got the level. But got some major gains going on, and I'm doing Motherload Mine right now. It's actually one of my favorite things to do in old school RuneScape. It's so relaxing, and it's nice to just, like, sit and chat in the CC or, you know, um, watch a good show or something. But I've always kind of postponed it because you get mining XP while you rune craft doing Dark Essence. So I kind of want to get 99 rune crafting before 99 mining. That being said, uh, I come back here every once in a while. I think I'll get 88 uh, mining and then go back to some rune crafting. Hey guys, what's up? It's Kay Jones, and I have not been playing much lately because, you know, it's been holidays and Christmas and all that, but I did get 88 in all stats. So my I got my rune crafting to 88, my agility to 88, my mining, and all that good stuff. So now my lowest stat is 88, which is awesome and i'm not very sure what i'm gonna do i've been doing some slayer and i think i'll stick to that for a while though so um just want to update y'all on the stats i've been getting some gains here and there here we go i got a master reward casket this thing took like a gajillion billion years but we're gonna open it up 323k what the heck is this red fire later? Okay, the wine's a Zamrak. I like. That literally took two hours. For 320k. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. 603k. Bruh, this was better than... This medium clue was better than my masters and my elite. I don't get it, man. Wow. Okay, I don't know if y'all can tell, but in my inventory, I got another God Sword Shard 2. So now I have six of these in my bank. I got one earlier today, and I didn't record it because I thought it would be, like, a short-lived thing. But I got another one, and I just don't know how I have six of them. It's crazy. But I just, oh, I guess God Sword Shard 2 li likes me. God Sword Shard 3! No, I need now I can finish my armadillo god sword. It was not that one actually be really cool though. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I can now PK with it. Right. I think we're good to go. I can make one of these armadillo god swords, and then we'll have three god swords completed, which is awesome. Let me go ahead and get that done. Got, finally got a God Sword Shard 
three. That was kind of crazy. Let me also get a hammer. <clears throat> but yeah, now we officially have an armadillo hilt. I mean, god sword complete. I have three out of the four god swords done on my Iron Man. I don't see myself going back to Zami for a while, but if I get, um, oh dear, I don't know how this works. Yeah, there we go. Um, if I get a Zami task, I might. It just kind of depends. I'm really wanting to finish Armadillo right now, so it really depends. Check it out, Armadillo God Sword. Let's go check this out. We're going to hit this thing. Woo! That looks so cool. Honestly, it has a beautiful special attack. Look at that. Except I can't hit anything, but looks so nice, guys. Oh my god, I got the rune pet. Rune guardian pet. Oh my gosh! <laughs> pets besides the heron <gasps> I cannot believe it I thought it wasn't me I said guys this is what happened there's an ultimate Iron Man over here I used the blood ruins on the thing and then I said and then I said congratulations and I'm walking and I oh my gosh guys so I made it green from the altar uh, nature altar and I locked it. It looks so nice. Oh my gosh, this is like my second one after the heron. And now I have four pets. I have the hellhound puppy, KBD, the rock golem, and also the rift guardian. So that's like so awesome. I was so shocked when that happened, guys. I told an ultimate Ironman congratulations and next thing I know, I turned around and that thing was following me. Because the, the ultimate Iron Man just got a level. So I was like, congrats. And I walked away. I was like, oh, he got the pet too. What? So, oh my gosh. Anyway, super big hype. What a great thing to get before starting work. All right, guys. Since I was on break for really such a long time, I thought I would post pictures of what I did in real life. So here's a picture of me at my graduation party. We just went to a restaurant with the family. I graduated with a bachelor's in finance, and I actually start my, start my new job tomorrow. I also went to iFly. I had some gift cards from my family, and it was a blast. I have a video I'll show you of me with the instructor. I, I really had no idea what I was doing, but it's a lot more complicated than it looks. You need to have your hands and feet in a certain position. Uh, too much weight on your legs will put you in a certain direction, and etc. And if you bend your legs, you'll sink, and if you straighten your legs, you'll, you'll rise. Most expensive 60 seconds of my life, but I went three times, so more like three minutes. It wasn't my money, like I said, I got a gift card for Christmas, but it was a blast, really. And here the instructor is taking me up all the way to the top. I got super dizzy during this, but it was phenomenal. It, I felt like I was going a lot faster than what it looks. And these instructors are incredible. They can do like backflips in the tunnels. They've had so much practice. It's very different from skydiving because it's more of you just in a vacuum chamber. But it still was pretty cool. Uh, when he took me out of the chamber here, I got really dizzy and bit the dust into some other guy. <laughs> but it was really fun. Alright guys, I think I'm going to end episode 31 with some clue scrolls and everything like that. So I had an elite right here, so let's give it a go. Oh my gosh, I got a master. Oh, now I have to do a master. And I got some fashion skate, man. I don't even know how much this is. That's an 833k item. Ah, yeah, yeah, look at this. I got a crown. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that actually looks really cool. King Sarthon. Nah, guys, but something I forgot to record earlier was I got 98 strength, and I'm getting really close to 98 attack and defense. 
solid. Okay, I think this will be my third master casket. Let's do this. I'm really scared. Okay, I'm not gonna look. I'm not gonna look. Ah, <laughs> that's so bad. What? Elites are better than that. <laughs> okay. My last elite was really good. Okay, hard clue casket. <laughs> 36k. Oh my gosh, that's so bad. Alright guys, I've got a medium and an easy clue, so we'll open both. Let's do the medium first. <laughs> 1.8k, okay, that's expected usually. Okay, let's try the easy. 674 GP. Okay, you never know what you're gonna get from these things though, so it's always good to, you know, record and see, but... I'm at 120 mediums and 29 easies. I was going to end this progress video at this point, but I'm 35k till 92 farming, so I'm gonna go get that real fast. E, 92 farming. Very nice. I feel like I should have a lot higher farming than what I have right now. It's just, I just don't do enough tree runs, but I'm trying to get back into it. Anyway, guys, that concludes episode 31. I can't believe we're in the 30s. It's nuts for episodes. But also wanted to thank everyone for my 5,000 subscribers. I, I cannot believe I'm at this point. I never, ever thought I would get to 5,000 subscribers. I mean, it is very shocking to see that I'm here. And I know that I wouldn't be where I am on YouTube without y'all support and it means the absolute world to me and I love this hobby and it's a blessing but also you know it comes with problems as in like mean comments and things like that but overall it has been a very pleasurable experience and I love making videos and I love communicating with y'all. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and if you're interested in subscribing to my channel, please feel welcome to. I will be posting new videos, and give this a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I will see y'all next time on my next videos on my channel. Bye, guys.